Hi, my name is uh, Raj. I am from Gujarat and uh, I am currently living in Canada and uh, uh, in Gujarat I was okay with my height, especially at a really young age. I was uh, the same height as my friends. Then later on, uh, when I went to Canada, I felt like I was lower than everyone else and uh, everyone was about the height of 5'9", 5'10", and I was, my current height is 5, closely 5'5", five, five, but I'm not 5'5", five, five, I'm 5'4 five, and half or something. And uh, ever since then, in Canada, I was 18 when I went to Canada, and uh, for three years I researched about limb lengthening, and I looked at all the different options in Gujarat, but uh, they were all for cheap but they don't have any experience and uh, that's when I saw uh, many different articles featured in NBC and many other BBC and different docu documentaries in YouTube about uh, Amar Sarin and how uh, this famous surgeon in uh, New Delhi uh, by the name of Dr. Amar Sarin who has worked with the creator of the surgery, Ilisarov, and uh, he's trained with a real person who invented this surgery, and that's where my confidence came from, and uh, after that, I, I, I looked at the price, and the price was uh, uh, good, it was within my budget, it was a little more, ex more than I expected, but I was uh, happy that I was working with uh, someone who is experienced in the field, especially uh, someone like Dr. Amar Sarin, where he has worked with a real person, a real doctor named Dr. Ilisarov for this surgery. So uh, that was my main concern. And uh, yeah, that's how I came here after three years. So when was your surgery? It was uh, October 14, about six days ago. Okay. So how, how is the pain right now? Pain? Uh, I don't feel any pain. Mm -hmm. So on a scale of one to ten, I would give zero. Only if I move way too much, mm -hmm. but right now I can you know, do all sorts of things, okay. but no pain. How is your experience? Uh, I was in Canada and uh, I wanted to do the surgery and I contacted uh, Amar Sarin through WhatsApp and uh, I messaged him a couple times and I, I asked him how long the surgery would be and he said, eh, the surgery itself, it's just one day, but you will have to stay here for at least three months. So I made sure that my uh, return flight is within uh, at least four months, so I could stay an extra month here. And I asked him what kind of expectations I can have, and he gave me, he answered all my questions very efficiently. And uh, after that, uh, I arrived in the New Delhi Indira Gandhi Airport, and uh, I was picked up by Amar Sarin's uh, team members and uh, I got back into the rehab where I stayed for one day. I, I came to the airport at night time. So yeah, I came into the uh, Amar Sarin's rehab center and uh, in the morning I met uh, Dr. Sharik and uh, I, I, I was scared at first because I didn't know what to expect. Then. He, told, he asked me to come downstairs and there was three floors and on all three floors uh, I met mo mostly more than 25, 21 uh, uh, patients. They all got their surgery done here and uh, he let me ask questions to all of them and my main question was, my main concern for this entire surgery itself was what was the amount of pain I have for the surgery and uh, everybody said uh, uh, everybody said there is not much pain but there was this one girl that I met she said on a scale of 1 to 10 she would say it's less than 2 which made me more which was the most satisfying answer because everyone else said there is no pain which I couldn't really believe but when she said on a scale of 1 to 10 it's not 9 or it's not 7 it's literally less than two, I was really happy, but I was still scared for the surgery because, you know, this is not a easy surgery for a fact. So, 
So after that, I was really happy because it's not just me in this rehab. I thought maybe there might be only two to three patients. When I came here, there was three floors and more than 21 patients. And I met all of them. And uh, I even met a guy who did uh, two parts of the leg. So they did femur and tibia, and he was doing an arm. So that's three surgeries, uh, which was really scary for me but I would uh, that was more comforting too because knowing that he did three surgeries it tells me that he was able to uh, realize that this is not that painful maybe I should do all three surgeries not just one so and uh, he was also from uh, Singapore and uh, I also met him and uh, after that, I was more happy and, and I was not scared as much. And uh, the day after that was my surgery. It was in October 14th uh, with uh, Dr. Amar Sarin. And uh, I went to the hospital. I met him and he kind of briefed me on what the surgery might look like. And that uh, he told me I would be under anesthesia so I wouldn't feel any pain. And... Uh, for the surgery, I was uh, I didn't feel any pain and I went to sleep and I don't know when I woke up, but uh, when I woke up, I didn't feel any pain. I was under uh, anesthesia. So and I stayed there for three days and uh, in, the, in the hospital, the nurses took care of me really well. And uh, I had a, I even had a dietitian who would come and ask me every day if uh, I need a change in diet uh, because uh, on my first day, I said I don't need any food. So dietitian was really concerned and uh, I also uh, had a personal caretaker. His, his name was uh, Vinay Singh and uh, he also took care of me really well and uh, I stayed, stayed there for three days and after that I said, said goodbye and I, then I came back to the rehab again. Uh, it's uh, been six days since surgery. My surgery was, like I said, uh, it was in October 14th, and right now it's October 20th, and uh, I can walk. Uh, I mean, I can uh, do my day-to-day -day activities really well, and uh, they have actually 24 hours uh, help available. I can actually use my phone and call them, but I don't really need that. I can move my legs just as fine, and there's no pain at all. And even the doctors discharge me three days after surgery. Usually they discharge me after, usually they discharge their patients after four days, but I, just, I got discharged at the third day. And uh, uh, I don't feel any pain. I can move my legs really fine. And uh, I can uh, do my day-to-day -day activities. There's a fridge here. And usually uh, I thought maybe I can call them to get something from the fridge, but I can get into the chair and uh, get it myself. I can even go to the bathroom myself. Mm -hmm.